Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In March 2024, images surfaced on the Chinese social media platform Weibo, offering a glimpse of the KJ A600, China's upcoming airborne early warning AEW, aircraft designed for deployment on the aircraft carriers of the People's Liberation Army Navy plan. Drawing inspiration from the advanced capabilities of the U.S. Navy's E-2 Hawkeye, the KJ-600 represents a significant stride in China's naval aspirations, promising continuous airborne surveillance and command and control functionalities. Crafted by the Xi'an Aircraft Company, the KJ-600 project initiated flight trials in the autumn of 2020. Sporting turboprop engines, the aircraft boasts a sturdy build featuring a commodious fuselage capable of accommodating a team of four to six personnel, essential for prolonged surveillance and command missions. A prominent feature of the KJ-600 is its sizable dorsal radome, likely housing an advanced active electronically scanned array AESA, radar system. The unveiled images showcase the aircraft in a gray livery, highlighting its straight high-wing configuration, a four-fin tail, and a tricycle landing gear, all indicative of China's ambitions to bolster its maritime surveillance and airborne command capabilities. Despite notable progress in flight trials, visual confirmation of crucial catapult launch and arrested recovery trials for carrier-based operations is yet to be obtained. Satellite image analysis reveals that the KJ-600 boasts a wingspan of 24.4 meters and a length of 18.4 meters, underscoring its compact design tailored for effective operations from aircraft carriers. Reports from late 2023 regarding intensive testing involving four to six prototypes suggest that the KJ-600 development program is in an advanced stage, potentially nearing low-rate initial production. With the envisioned integration of the KJ-600 into plan operations, China aims to fortify its maritime surveillance and airborne command capabilities, thereby bolstering its strategic standing in maritime domains. This next-generation aircraft serves as a testament to China's advancements in defense technology and its dedication to upholding a formidable and adaptable maritime presence. Questions persist regarding the KJ-600's performance as a deck-based aircraft, particularly in comparison to American counterparts utilizing a catabar, catapult-assisted takeoff but arrested recovery, configuration for launch. Presently, there is no evidence to confirm the KJ-600's compatibility with China's existing aircraft carriers, the Liaoning and the Shandong, which utilize ski-jump deck sans catapults. Analysts speculate that China's third aircraft carrier, equipped with a flat deck and electromagnetic catapults, may accommodate the KJ-600. The KJ-600 likely employs two WJ-06C turboprop engines, although a transition to the newer WJ-10 engines remains plausible in the future. Its compact fuselage design mirrors the lengths of carrier-based aircraft such as the J-15 fighter jet and the Z-18 early warning helicopter. Positioned atop its medium fuselage, the KJ-600 carries a radar akin to those observed on China's preceding early warning aircraft, the KJ-2000 and KJ-500, although it remains uncertain whether this radar rotates. That's all for now, see you later.